Okay, um, this manual steer box is going to go into this uh, 69 Nova. It's out of a 69 Camaro. Um, got rid of the power steering that was in it originally. And I made some marks here and I just was uh, checking the centering this uh, since it's not, it's just the pump itself. Um, I've got some markings in here because I've already done this, but I'm going to go through the normal process. If you look at the uh, actual pitman arm splines here, you can mark the flat spots with a marker. Um, I have white chalk marks here because basically you'll turn it all the way left and right. Uh, this way here, I've got it all, all, all the way to this white mark with the chalk line. And if you turn it the other way and you count your turns, um, like here, it's like that's a half. You know, one, half, two, half, three, half, four, half, five, half, six, half, and then it, that's it, six and a half. So it has a little play in it, um, but if you if you look here at the uh, markings you have, like if I look at the um, dots. If you just focus on one dot, <clears throat> one dot that's on the flat part of the spline, you'll have the left and right. So this one here stops um, where you stop. If you make that your mark, you can put a mark on the spline on the flat spot here. And uh, right here on the flat spot, I put a mark. And then now you can turn it the other way to verify it. You're going to go the same way, half. And then you've got one, half, two, half, three, half. Four, half, five, half, six, and then a half. And then you can see that dot on this side now. I put a white mark here, and that's where it stops. So if you have six and a half, you're going to go three and a quarter turns in uh, to center this up. Uh, so you're going to go half, one, half, two, half, three, and then a quarter. And then if you look, where this dot is here, I've got a center mark right there, and that's where the center of this is going to be when you have your drive shaft, or I mean, uh, gearbox when you're centering it up. So now you have this center, and then if you look at when this is going to be mounted on the car in this position, this line will be forward towards you and the car. Uh, so I marked that with a, a long line. Um, now you can use that as a basis for putting the pitman arm on, and then you can actually take the uh, coupler here and you can put it in the proper position too. This gets splined and then on the shaft you've got a small bolt and a, a large bolt and then you have this on the shaft and then you have a tightening nut. But that's how you center up the shaft here uh, when you're looking for exchanging either a new uh, gearbox whether it's power steering or not. Uh, that's usually the method that I go with.